I'm Dr. N.K. Venkat Ramana, neurosurgeon, uh, Brains Super Speciality Hospital. Epilepsy in majority of the times is uh, treatable and very well controllable and uh, with good medicines, good dosage and good duration, most of the epilepsies can be brought under control. Once it is under control, it, all the normal activities of the life can be continued as usual. But there are situations in a small percentage, epilepsy can continue and become aggressive in spite of good amount of medications. And we have to keep on increasing the dose of medication. Sometimes people will not be able to tolerate the doses. And this is typically called as the uncontrolled epilepsy. When the epilepsy becomes uncontrolled, they need to be investigated thoroughly to look for all possible abnormalities in the brain to identify where exactly the electrical abnormality is starting, spreading and progressing. So accordingly, uh, we can evaluate and uh, make sure that we remove that abnormal area in the brain called epilepsy surgery and sometimes there can be abnormal uh, lesions in the brain. For example, a scar uh, because of the injury or whatever is the reason or a, a stroke related problem, a vascular related problem vascular abnormality, cavernomas or a small tumor, all of them can lead to epilepsy. By treating this cause, they are called secondary epilepsies and once you treat the cause, the epilepsy can be controlled. If not, the primarily abnormal brain can be removed surgically and then we can control the epilepsy. There are situations where significant amount of brain has become abnormal where surgery cannot be performed. In that situations, there are options where we can create a, a palliative surgery so that the electrical dis discharges cannot cross over to the other side of the brain so that at least you will not lose consciousness and fall down. That is one way uh, prevent uh, the severity of the epilepsy at the same time frequency and also the risk of falling and getting injured. And there are other new procedures which are coming now called vagal nerve stimulation we put an implant onto the vagal nerve on the left side of the neck and it's a very simple outs, uh, outside the head procedure and by continuously stimulating it does two things one it will control the epilepsy very well we can modify the medications the second thing it will also give a warning that the seizure is about to come so that one can take precautions so that he doesn't fall and get injured